We're here in Seattle for this NFC West matchup between the 49ers and the Seahawks. You know, Phil, we don't normally set up a game by talking about the tight end position, but that could be a very important part of this one today. Uh, you know, the NFL has changed. It, it, for years, it was all about the wide receivers, and we have seen of late the tight ends. Why are they so such a big part of the offense now? Well, they line up in the middle of the field. They can move. They can go in motion. And who's going to cover them inside where you can go anywhere? Tough to do it. These tight ends will have a, they will have a big impact on the outcome of this game today. setting up the return. They face first down. Hand off. Running to the left side. Well, when you try to tackle this guy, his legs are the size of a refrigerator, so hard to wrap him up. That's why he picked up the big game. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Staying with the running game on first down. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. That was a nice run that time by the offense, picking up those yards. And any time you gain more than three yards on a running play in the National Football League, it is deemed successful. Offside defense. Well, looks like the defender was caught in the neutral zone, Phil. Yeah, he was. Good job by the quarterback. You know, he made that little voice inflection. That'll get him every time. His quarterback's a little sneaky, you know. That flag gives them a new set of downs. Screen. As much as these guys practice during the offseason, training camp, during the week, you think receivers and quarterbacks would always be on the same page. That time they were not, and it's another incomplete pass. Second down after the incompletion. Wide open for the catch. How you perform inside the red zone is often the difference in a game, and we'll get an early taste of that. No doubt about it, Jim. you got to be creative when you get in the red zone. We'll see what the offense calls. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Throwing now to his left. Ball slipped out of his hands. Do one thing at a time. Catch the football, then do the next thing, run with it. He tried to run with it too quick. That's why he dropped it. Second down here. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Got a hand on it, and it's incomplete. Anytime you get a chance as a defender in your own end zone to knock it down, that's what you do. Nice play by the defensive guy. Play number six coming up on this drive. Third down and ten. Now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. Offense lines up here. What a touchdown there for the offense. The quarterback just fires that football in there. Look at the defenders around the receiver, but the receiver big enough, tough enough to go up in there and make that catch. The 49ers in kickoff return formation. They're setting up return. Oh, the, we've got an injured player on the field. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field, and my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no doubt about it. That makes everybody nervous. Gore's lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. 
First and ten. And the give to Frank Gore. So many things you can do on first down, and what do you come up? You come up with that play. That was just a bad play call. Second down following the run. The wide receiver shifting around in motion. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Brought down just two yards shy of the first down marker. Well, the defense in a perfect situation at time. They make the quarterback throw it short, but then nobody makes the tackle. Get in position, wrap your arms around the legs of these receivers and bring them down. He makes the catch. It's a touchdown. Good job by the offense. They get in there. They tie this game up. Now we'll see if the defense can take advantage of that momentum and keep it on their side. And the point after is good. 49ers setting up for the kickoff. They crash into him, ending the return at the 20-yard line. Offense lines up here. Midway through the first as they go ground here. And gets the first down. Well, the defensive coach is going to be upset after this play. After that long run, terrible angles, and really just a lack of hustle by the defense gives up the long run. First and ten, leading on that running attack again here on first down. He's got some daylight. That last play made by Patrick Willis. A lot of ways to get plays in the NFL. It doesn't always have to be by a pass. Good job that time by the running back. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Back to the ground. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. When you make play calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. Second down coming up. Wilson sells the play fake and looks downfield. That catch, good for a first down. That time it was an easy completion for the quarterback on the play action pass, and it fools the defense because look how aggressive the offensive line is. They sold the play to the defense, and the quarterback took advantage. Now first and ten. The quarterback will hand it off, and it's Patrick Willis who makes the tackle. And now they'll try over again on second down. Second and nine. Set up screen. Makes the catch. The tackle is made, but the first down is picked up. Nice play call that time by the offensive coordinator. A little screen pass to the halfback. He knew the defensive line was going to be charging hard. They were, and it picked up some nice yards. First and ten. Going off tackle here. They tackle him for a loss. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. The 49ers defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Second down and 13. They'll run it off the toss. He's going to be tackled right around the 21-yard line. Russell Wilson has it under center. Third and three. They're going to get him here for a sack. Oh, there's nothing worse as a quarterback to have pressure up the middle from an interior defensive tackle. 
Uh, hard to see down the field, can't make a decision, and that time it leads to a sack. And that's going to do it for the first quarter. We'll be back from Seattle for the start of the second after the break. Nickel formation here for the defense. McCoy's got it on a pass that had some heat. Another first down by the offense. The defense is definitely getting fatigued. And when you get fatigued, you cannot think. So look out. Marching down the field and taking their time. Now makes the move to the right. Powers his way across. Touchdown. I'd say this run by the offense is just, it's arrogance. They just say, you can't stop us. And they lined up and just shoved it down the defense's throat. Nice run there on first and goal for the touchdown. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. have a chance to take off that brings the play to an end Colin Kaepernick under center First and ten. Frank Gore gets it here. And that's good for only a yard or two. It's now second down. Kaepernick still has it after some nifty play action. But it's incomplete. He passes in the NFL. They always serve a purpose. You're not always going to get the completion but at least it gets the defense thinking that you will try some long throws down the field. Third and eight coming up after the incompletion. The quarterback motions the wide receiver. Trying to work that left side. Makes the catch in the open field. Well, if you want to be a good play-action pass team, it's always nice to have a good running game. Make the defense dig in and try to stop your run. When they do that, you fool them. You fake it. You throw it down the field. That, that's, that's about as easy as it gets. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. The give. Taking off. A game-breaker. Touchdown. Well, that score ties the game up. Now, on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. Offside, defense. The defender got caught in the neutral zone right there. That'll cost him five. Yeah, he's a little too anxious. You know, all these defenders, they got one thing in common. You know what that is? They hate quarterbacks. <laughs> they want to get there a little too... Nervous air gets him caught in the neutral zone. Signaling for fair catch. <laughs> Offense lines up here. First and ten. They'll go ground. Left side. The ball is jarred loose. A recovery by the defense. That's what you call a takeaway. The defense just makes such a hard hit that they take the football away from the offense and they recover the fumble. First down here. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. And he's tackled at the 32-yard line. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run.
Offense lines up here. Second and six. Gore. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. The off-tackle run is just what it says it is. You're going to read the tackle's block and decide whether you're going to go inside or outside. Usually, this is the first running play every team puts in their offense when they go to training camp. Colin Kaepernick, under center. First and ten. They hand it off to him again. Safeties now in the NFL have to cover like a corner, and they got to tackle like a linebacker. And that time, the safety came up, and he tackled like a linebacker and stopped that outside run. Be second down. They feed it to him again, trying the right side. And we've reached the two-minute warning. Let's roll! Let's roll! It's third down coming up. Kaepernick's got the football after the play fake. He's got the grab. Ball is out. This one's going back the other way. In on the stop. Well, the one thing we know about the NFL, when you have the football in your hands, they are going to attack it. You've got to know that as a ball carrier, protect it a lot better. Inside the last two minutes, this one had to be instigated by the folks upstairs. They challenged the call on the field, and in fact, it was the proper thing to do. The play is overturned. Yeah, good job by the officials upstairs seeing it, knowing there was a mistake on the field. That's what I love about the NFL. They're not afraid to, admit, to say they made mistakes and turn them around. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Holds him to a yard. Good job by the defense that time. Everybody's expecting a pass. They were ready for the run, and they stopped the offense for a short game in the red zone. Seahawks with a nickel look here on defense. Second and goal from the three to the right. Getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the goal line. So what will the offense do? They, they better be creative. That's all I know.
defense comes out in the nickel. McCoy's into the end zone for the touchdown. Well, this quarterback is not afraid to score on the goal line, that's for sure. Not afraid about taking a hit from one of those big, mean defensive players. He runs a quarterback sneak and gets a touchdown. The PAT sails wide here. The Seahawks are in shape now to return the kick. And he'll start his return. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. They come to the line, and it's first down. Gets away from the pressure, has some space, ball is out. The offense was able to recover the ball. Just when you thought they may have a costly turnover, they're able to somehow recover the football. You know, Jim, you know what happens to guys on offense when they fumble the football? You know where they go? To the bench. That's where this man is going. You fumble it, you're in trouble, you take him out of the game. Shot, shot, shot. And here we have second down. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Russell Wilson connects with Golden Tate. How do you stop these receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game. Uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes. They go up. They make the catch. All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. Looking to the right side and throwing. Russell Wilson connects with Golden Tate. Perfect defense call that time. They allow the catch. The coach on the sidelines going, well, what else do you want me to do? We had the guy double covered, and you still couldn't make the play. After the long gain, let's see what they do here. He's looking long. Touchdown. Nothing like having a quarterback who has a good arm who can, who can just fire that football into some tight spots, and then it helps you in the receiver got the talent and the courage to go in there and make that tough play. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. And he's going to be taken down well short of the 20. Let's mark him at the 15. Colin Kaepernick, under center. First and ten. Play fake here. Launches it down the field. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. Failing to complete that one, so second down here. Looking to go deep. Right down Broadway, the tackle is made. So that's going to do it here for the first half. Seahawks are up here in this one. We're back here now in this one, where the Seahawks lead by one. They want the football back as they line up now in an onside kick formation. The onside kick is turned away, and the receiving team has it. Colin Kaepernick under center. And now here's the first snap of the second half. Balls out. The defense has the football. Well, that's not the call of takeaway. That time the defense just hit the ball carrier so hard that he had to give the football up, and they lose it. First down coming up. 
looking to scramble. He's got a wide open alley. And he's going to be tackled right around the 35-yard line. That's a nice play that time by the offense, getting the first down. They're up here in the second half, and they're moving the football. That's a great field. First down, offense ready for the snap. Working that left side. Makes the grab and keeps the ball moving down the field. That's a first down catch. Well, Jim, I always say it's about deception when you're playing offense. That time, the play action fake by the quarterback was so good that defense didn't even see that he still had the football. And he throws it down there for a nice completion. Ah, the defense got away with one that time. It wasn't a good play in their part. It was just bad timing by the quarterback and receiver. Second down following that incompletion. Eyeing that left side. And it's incomplete. Just couldn't hold on to it after the hit. That You've seen as you watch the receiver trying to make that catch. He knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. Third and ten. And the throw is incomplete. from the shotgun. The Seahawks are in the end zone for the touchdown. What a tough throw and catch into a tight spot right there for the touchdown. But in today's game, these players are so good that you have to throw it in traffic. They've got to make the catch. That time he did. The 49ers in kickoff return formation. Colin Kaepernick under center, first and ten. Gore's got it on the handoff. Five, maybe six out of that. Well, that was a nice run that time off tackle. And listen, this is a bread and butter play in the NFL. It's about power running. Can your offensive tackle make the block to free up that running back so he has a chance to get in that secondary and make a nice run out of it? Second down, four to go. Quarterback, quick toss to the outside. And they knock him down just a yard away from the first. In this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time, they stopped that run just for a short game. The Seahawks come out in the nickel. Third and one. Throws to the right. That ball is going the other way. Good piece of tackle. Linebackers nowadays are so talented. They can just do everything. Uh, they're strong enough to stop the run. Well, how about this interception? Good job, good being of the quarterback, and a nice catch. First down here. To the ground here. Running to the right. Game of six. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down, and he's in pain. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is, I think he's going to be okay. And once he gets a little um, 
uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. How about the defensive line? Getting that penetration, getting off the football at the snap, and getting it done, getting in the backfield and making that tackle. Third down at seven. Play action, throws the pass. Incomplete, almost intercepted. You're near midfield, it's fourth down, what do you do? I got the answer right here. You punt it. Play field position, make the other offense drive the length of the field to score. Wilson standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Ooh, they failed to pick up the first, and the ball will go back to the other side. Well, they don't get it on fourth down. That was, man, that was a quick drive, wasn't it, Jim? That was just bad play calling, bad execution, and go to the sideline. That's where you deserve to be. Now on first down. The wide receiver in motion, Kaepernick from the gun. They're going to get him this time. Well, that's a sign of a good defense. When you can sack the quarterback, when you're just rushing the defensive lineman, you don't need any tricks, you don't need any blitzes. Man, that's talent. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Tries to ward off a defender with a stiff arm. Well, they complete the pass, Jim, but doesn't get the first down. Sooner or later, you got to throw one down the field. Offense needs two yards here on third down after that pass play. Looks to his left. Ball's picked off. Bringing the play to an end. Your linebackers, they got to be able to do everything. They got to be big enough to get in there and stop the run, and also athletic enough to be able to get in position and make an interception. Good job by the linebacker. First down on the way. Lynch going to lose yards here. Now the play is there to be made, but the offensive player doesn't get it done. Bad job on first down. After running it, it's second down. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. Hard to play man-to-man -man against such a quality wide receiver. He's fast, he's big. You got to mix up the coverage. You play straight man-to-man, -man, you're going to give up a lot of completions. First down and 10. Here's the running play. Off tackle. And Navarro Bowman brings him down. When you have an offense like this that just keeps getting first downs, not only are they moving in scoring position, but they're giving their defense a lot of rest. Baldwin's going to get set in the slot for this snap. First and ten. They'll stay on the ground on first down. Goes to the left and pick up about four. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. He'll fire it out to the left. Brings it into his body. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Davis is playing out of position in the backfield here. First and ten. Screen pass. The pass complete. If I'm on the defense and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that it is a run. If they have the courage to throw it, let them. If they do, of course, it'll be a touchdown. Hey, hey, hey. 
Second down coming up. Marshawn Lynch takes the football. Ken, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Another handoff. Going to be a tackle for a loss. Terrible call that time by the coach. The defense was expecting run. They were up there. They were aggressive. Crowd the line of scrimmage. And you just you just played right into their hands. And they got the tackle for the loss. He'll take the snap. The first here in the fourth quarter. Touchdown. Seahawks. What a tremendous throw by the quarterback that time for the touchdown. What confidence he has in that arm. Small window. Very little room to throw that football in there. He didn't worry about it. Fired it. Got the touchdown. The kicking team now getting set here for what looks like an onside kick. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered. Frank Gore is in the backfield. Here comes the wide receiver in motion. First and ten. Going for the deep ball. And they can't connect. That's what you have to do as a defensive back. you got to wait to the last second. Wait till the receiver uses his hands. And once they go up, Put your hand in between them and knock that football down. What a play. Second down and 10. The throw to the left and sailing out of bounds. in the backfield. Kaepernick's back in shotgun formation. And they bring down the quarterback, and it's a three and out for the offense. They're pressuring the quarterback, that's what you love to do in the NFL from the defensive side. That time, they blitz. It was quick, it was fast, and they get a sack on the quarterback. From the gun. He wants to go deep. Makes the catch. Touchdown. That was a sweet touchdown right there. Just a nice throw by the quarterback. He put it right on the money. The receiver makes the catch. Beautiful touchdown. Go get set. Looking to convert on this two-point try. There's some shifting around in the backfield. And the give, you talk about momentum, that turns into an eight-point trip, the touchdown and the two. This offense and the head coach and the offensive coordinator, they're all aggressive. So, hey, well, it's not good enough just to get a touchdown. They want to get that extra point or two points. Nice job that time. Sean Lynch is in the backfield. First and ten. Here's the handoff. Running off tackle. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense. 
and now they have a good situation. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Right side, breaks the tackle. Nowhere else to go, and he's out of bounds. When you run off tackle, one of the things you're looking for is for your tackle to make a good block, and then if you have a lead fullback, can he get past him and block the linebacker to free up the halfback so he can go in between them and get in the secondary and make a big play? Third and two. He'll fire it out to the left. Baldwin's going to pull in the bullet pass. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. That reception gave them the first down. Looking down the field, and he's forced to the ground. I know a lot of people are going to be surprised by this, but when you take those blindside hits, they don't hurt as much as you think because you had no idea it was coming, your body's loose, and you can absorb the hit. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. The reception, easy, wide open. Nice catch that time by the wide receiver on the slant valve. Quarterback puts it right on target. They've got a first down now after that catch. Looking at every option. Tate's lined up now as a slot receiver. They need to get the playoff. Throwing now to his left. Tackle down at the 22. Well, that's a nice completion by the offense. And what it does, it just puts them in a more manageable situation so they can pick up that third down. If they're going to have any chance at all here late in the fourth, the defense must make a big stop and give the ball back to the offense. Down and two. Setting up screen. Incompletion by the quarterback that time. It was good, tight, man-to-man -man coverage. We're late in the fourth, and the offense is just trying to sit on the lead. That's a failed conversion, but you might as well look at it like a turnover. It's going back the other way. Well, that's four plays and out for the offense, and that was bad. Bad play calling, bad play, bad execution. Go to the bench and try to rethink what you're doing. Time in this one's running out, and the defense knows it needs another stop. An off-tackle run, it's a staple of all offenses in the NFL. And a general rule is you run off the right tackle because he is the power tackle where the left tackle is the pass blocker. Two-minute warning. Ohio! 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 We're drawing near a close, and the defense is trying to preserve a victory. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Tackles made. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game.
let's see how they back up the big play here. Running back, gets it on the handoff. That's a three-yard game. Good job by the offense getting in the red zone. Now you're down some points. You got to find a way to score a touchdown. Colin Kaepernick, under center. Second down and seven. Strong eye handoff here. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. The 49ers have saved all three of their timeouts for here in the fourth quarter. Third down and three. Heading right. He's brought down. That's going to bring up fourth down. Hard to score a touchdown sometimes when you get in the red zone in the NFL. Why? Because the defense doesn't have to worry about passes down the field. The offense runs it. They are ready to get it done, and they do, and stop the offense for a short game. for an open receiver on the right. Touchdown as we near the end of this one. Well, here we are. It's a tie game now. We'll see how the teams react to it. Will it be positive or negative? Lining up now for the two-point conversion. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. Outside runs take time. And when you run outside, you expect the safety to get up there with that extra time and make the tackle. Good job that time by the safety. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Baldwin's handed the football. To the right side, they bring him to the turf. The 49ers call a timeout and are left now with only one. That last play was a run. Third down coming up. Wilson from the shotgun. The hack was going to be made, but he's beyond the first down. Well, that was a nice job by the offense. It just puts him in a better position. Nice little throw and catch. One more play, and it's in the books. Airing it out. Almost intercepted that time. There it is. The game has come to an end. It was a good one throughout. Hotly contested.